Um, I started at the cafe about 12 years ago. Uh, I bought the premises and was going to open up a gallery and uh, just do cakes and coffee. Uh, the gallery side of things didn't grow and the food side started to escalate and sort of organically grew really. And I'm vegetarian anyway, um, so it was always going to be vegetarian, I wouldn't serve meat. Um, and the vegan side sort of got, uh, with advice from my customers who were vegans, I sort of um, got more and more into the vegan side of things and realised that I had to provide that for people and was quite happy to do that. A lot of the food that I make in the cafe is homemade because I think that's what people like these days and also you know where the ingredients have come from and um, food that I would want to eat so I know my customers would like to eat. One of my um, most popular dishes in the cafe is the Welsh rarebit. It's a mixture of um, cheddar cheese, red leicester and a couple of other ingredients and it's proved to be the most popular dish in, on the menu. That's, I sell mostly Welsh rarebits. <laughs> Um, I actually decided to add the addition of cauliflower underneath the cheese and tomato underneath the cheese and they've also proved to be extremely popular. So uh, it's a bit weird to say your signature dish is uh, Welsh rare, but, but that is indeed what mine is. I've also gone into um, a sort of range of ales uh, recently, um, mainly because my son works at state-of-the-art microbrewery and I thought it would be nice to have my own range of beers. So they produced the beer for me and I have designed the labels and set, set that up. I also sell them at the moment for Christmas presents with a, a bottle opener which has been made out of recycled skateboards by a local craftsman. So I thought that would be nice to bring local crafts into the cafe and sell those with a locally crafted beer. The reason why I do this as a living, because it's hard work, it, I don't get paid masses amount of money, but what I really love is um, working as in the community and working with the people that come into the cafe, that is the main reason for doing it. I think when people actually are appreciative of your food and you put a plate full of food on in front of them and they get excited about it, that makes the job worth doing. I also love the customers that I have because I have quite a range of customers from well-known musicians and national film directors coming in and also dancers, artists, ordinary people off the street. Just if, all my customers are amazing, whoever they are. Um, I have actually just gone down part-time um, in the cafe. In the time that I have left, I've decided to set up a greetings card company um, where I can actually try and sell my cards and designs to outlets other than the cafe. So that's my next plan, to try and do that as well as doing the cafe. So I intend to stay in the cafe for a few years yet.